I really got interested in fermentation um, at a pretty young age. Uh, I was fascinated with how you made wine and um, I didn't really know that you made beer basically the same way, but started figuring out how to ferment things when I was in, uh, in high school. Uh, I was interested in brewing because I really like craft beer. There wasn't a lot available at the time when I started brewing. Um, it was also uh, more expensive than what I could afford, so I wanted to find a way to be able to consume craft beer um, uh, and a little bit you know, cheaper, something that I could afford. So I figured if I could make it, um, I could probably save some money there. I also spent a lot of time as a chef um, in my early 20s, and I really liked cooking, and brewing and cooking are very similar. Um, you kind of create the recipe and the methods that which you use to create it um, and the ingredients in which you use kind of dictate what the finished product is. So that's kind of how I got into it. Our day starts pretty early in the morning. We get here about 7 a.m. Uh, one of the first things I do is go around and uh, take some gravities on the beer. So that's, uh, we measure sugars in the beer to see um, where it's at in the fermentation. So I'll do that primarily first thing in the morning. Um, another thing that we do early in the morning when we get here is we do inventory. How much beer did we sell yesterday? How much beer was created yesterday? Uh, you have to be uh, very conscious of your sanitation. A lot of cleaning. There's quite a bit of cleaning. We clean kegs. Every tank we, um, that beer goes in gets uh, thorough cleaning by hand. Then it gets um, uh, what we call a sip or clean in place. So we pump um, different cleaners, whether that's a caustic or um, we have a number of different chemicals we can use for that. It also gets an acid cycle and then finally a sanitation cycle. So there's a lot of um, cleaning that goes into it. Um, a lot of people don't see beer as food, but it is. So just like in a kitchen, you would want to keep everything clean and sanitary. Same thing with the brewing. Um, so that's a lot of what we do. Beer like this. Yes. Okay. But it's hard to believe that we'll Probably adding hops to the boil. You get this big hop aroma. It hits you in the face. And, uh, and it's exciting too because it makes the boiling, makes the boiling work foam up. And um, so it's, it's one of the more exciting parts of the day. Yeah. Yeah. Our flavor, that's where we use to get our aroma. Yeah. 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 Yeah.